Hello everyone and welcome back. Uh, before I you know, show you the uh, lock and who sent it to me that I have in the vise, i like to say that today, uh, I know it's the 3rd of November, but I haven't done much picking in October. So today is going to be the last time I use these uh, pink uh, to symbolize uh, uh, Breast Cancer Awareness Month in October. Okay, so with that being said, this is a uh, Corbin uh, kick sent to me by Cameron Dunn, is number 27, 915, 2018, and he titled it Bullseye. And that's the bidding. Uh, that's the key way. As you see, as you see, it works beautifully. I have not picked this yet. So, without further ado, let's see. Uh, I'm going to start with 50,000 top of the keyway. And uh, I don't know. I got a bunch of picks here to my left. So let's start with the uh, homebrew. Okay. Come on, baby. Focus. Okay. Let's go inside. Okay, the shaft is kind of tall right about here, so it's oversetting some pins. Uh, so I'm going to use this one by WSP, uh, Washington State Picker. Hmm, that sounds like I'm overset. Okay, five again, get me a uh, full set. Camera, my man. Uh, I don't know what you got in this. Well, it feels like you got some massive springs in there. Well, I apologize. Ooh, thought I had it. I thought it was gonna open there. Apologize for not picking. I have a uh, bad hand. I may need surgery. Uh, it's been two weeks since I had shots and nothing. Oh, there we go. It opened up in three. All right, man. Woohoo. <laughs> All right. Cameron, thank you so much, my man. Again, awesome lock. Uh, let's back out. Put this up. Keep it in frame right there. You guys can see. Whip it, whip it good. That's a song by the SOS band. If any of you guys uh, into that kind of music back in the 70s, 80s. All right, let's see if we can get this clip off. Without locking it. I am. Oh, man, my hand. Uh, oh, no, it's not coming out that way. Excuse me. Probably will, but would. Let me go. Like that. Like that. Ooh, almost like the ooh. A lot of oohs. Ooh, ah. Come on and party. All right, I'm going to shim it. Like I say, I shim everything. Okay. And pins are facing that way. Cool. Ooh. I got the slipsies. Looks like he threaded. Come on, baby. Two, three, and four. Uh, everything needed to be picked. There's a Javi. Here it is. See everything was nice. Nice. Looks like uh, looks like five might be a reduced diameter. 
But BOP and enough jabbers, enough running your gippers. Let's get a little close here. Get close and personal. Okay, one. Uh, one key pen is nice little spool. I like that. Two is a really deep spool with a sharp edge. Okay. Three standard. Four is double serrated. And five. Yep, yeah, like I said, it's a almost like a T pen. Uh, reduced diameter on the top there. And nothing done on one and five. Cool, yeah. Maybe it'll fit in this one. Yep. Okay, let's get this sham out of the way. And I don't have a marker. But let's do this. I want to make sure I put it back together the right way. Put a little chicken scratch on there. Okay. All right, the front is uh, flush. Anyway. Uh -huh. Oh, nice. That looks like a mushroom with a short copper. I got a oh, look in it. Looks like it's a uh, threaded. Two look like <clears throat> multiple serration spool kind of thing. Three. Oh, and also copper spring. Uh, three is multiple serration. Looks like that's a brass brass spring. Hmm. Holy crap. Five is a beautiful, beautiful deep spool. Come on. No more dropsies. With a copper spring. And four. Looks like. Yep. Multiple serrations with a reduced uh, diameter. And a copper spring. And there's my probage. Let's see. Because it kind of looked like. Yeah. You guys can see that, right? Maybe. Maybe, a, maybe I'm going blind. Oh, wow. It's weird. Huh. It looks like it has not undercutting, but overcutting. Oh, come on. I don't know if you guys can see that. See the little grooves? Especially number one. Yeah, so. Yeah. And I think it's uh, from manufacturing. Okay. Let's do this quick. It's nine and a quarter minutes. All right. I'm going to show you these pins. You still see the... Uh, flakes oops don't drop it don't drop it fatty okay that's one key pin this is beautiful that's that is a mushroom spool if i ever seen one look at that oh come on baby look at that beautiful 
Oops. Wrong slot. Uh, that's a deep spool. Mm. Yep, nice deep spool there. Um, come on, baby. Come on. There you go, you can see it like that. Multiple serrations. Uh, standard. Keep in in three. Come on, baby. Maybe, yeah, there we go. Multiple serrations. And it looks like it's reduced diameter as well. Number four. Come on. I'm going to tap on the screen. Double serrations. There you go. It's like a spool with the bottom of, bottom of it to me is a spool and then like triple serrations there. Reduced diameter like a T pen, a little bigger than a T pen. And this one is a beauty too. Nice deep spool. And you got uh, one and two, four and five are copper. And number three is brass, in my opinion. What you know what to say about opinions. But anyway, everyone, thank you for joining me in this adventure here. It's been 11 minutes going on 12. Thank you so much, Cameron, for sending me this lock and all the other ones. Uh, I'll try to do some more picking. Uh, thank you so much. Uh, as, uh, as long as my hand uh, can take it, uh, there's a... I have an issue with a tendon right here that runs all the way down here. And the thumb has a groove uh, that the uh, surgery is going to, I'm going to need surgery to rectify that with the loose cut here and here. And there's, like I said, there's a groove here. They'll use something like a Dremel to widen that gap in that groove to allow the uh, tendon to go up and down. Because right now when I move my thumb, it's like click, 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 click. And I can't open my hand like that. So anyway. Enough of my problems. All right, everyone. Thank you so much. Be safe. Be legal. And as always, stay calm and pick on. Thanks a lot, buddy, Cameron, for this uh, wonderful lock, bud. Thank you. Bye-bye.